to Crazy Fear Girl Show. We hope you guys are having an amazing day. So, guys, we are back. I am back. And we are going to be reacting to Andor. So, this is a very exciting show to be watching because obviously it is related to Rogue One and it is one of my favorite sort of parts of Star Wars. Rogue One felt so different compared to the rest. It, I don't know why, but it felt like a lot darker, a lot more mature, and just a whole different direction than the rest of Star Wars. Like, I love, you guys know this, I love The Mandalorian, I love all that stuff in terms of, like, you know, like, Anakin, Luke Skywalker, all that stuff, but this is so separated from all that. It's more political, it's more serious, and it's, it's, um, like, the different direction is makes it more interesting. And especially because someone actually said it really well on Tumblr the other day, I was reading it. They said, Andor's going to be such an exciting show because it's literally from the perspective of Cassian Andor, who is basically no one in the world or perspective of Star Wars. So basically, yes, he is a fighter in the Rebellion, he's someone who's fighting for freedom and hope, but his role is so small compared to everybody else, and it's from a perspective that's... Like, I think that we haven't seen very recently in sort of Star Wars. So I'm really excited to watch this. I'm so excited to see all the episodes because obviously we were blessed with three episodes. But before that, please don't forget to like, subscribe and comment if you enjoyed this video. But also keep up to date with all my other reactions to more TV shows, movies and video games. So without further ado, let's jump straight into it. Ooh, very ominous. <laughs> Already. <laughs> Oh, there he is. So weird. It's very cyberpunk like. <laughs> so <laughs> they got good chemistry. <laughs> Ooh, looks like a weirdo. This is something amusing. What? You keep looking over it like there's something funny. Boy, you're not that important. Ooh, his sister, okay. Great! Great opening. Oh, These are the drunk guys. Yeah. Oh, what a shot. What like idiots. Oh! Douchebag. Nice! Nice. Oh. He's taking it. It's up. Well, no. Oh, he hit his head. Oh, no. I tried to grab you and, and he fell. He hit his head. We're going together. Let's go and what happened. Oh! Damn, Cassian. Oh, my God. What an opening. Yeah, I like this. Already. So good. Totally different feeling. Totally different atmosphere. I definitely am in full support of it. Ferex, Milani System, Free Trade Sector. I grabbed what you touch and told me. Oh. Cassian. Cassian. Ooh. Too many dead, sir. Employees. That's not worth staying up for, then I'm not worthy of the info. Have you heard of that for you? No witnesses in the actual crime. It's usually quite busy there. Apparently not. This happened just outside the district. At Who the saw them? The Call of resources. I can bring this case to Stop. I don't mean just the talking. I mean, stop. I want you to conjure a suitable accident. And let's make sure it's on the far side of the plaza. Let's get it outside the leisure zone. But they were murdered. No. They were killed in a fight. They were in a brothel, which we're not supposed to have. Something sad but inspiring in a mundane sort of way. That's fucked. Waiting when I get back. Oh, he ain't happy. I guess this guy is keen to show his potential. Damn. I really need this. Let 
Why does he have chemistry with everyone? It's annoying. It's like Pedro. Go away. <laughs> Mm, that guy, I feel like he'll betray her because he feels like he's just not being, you know, appreciated. We are simply asking for information. Have you ever been here? What difference does that make? They have their own way of doing things. This is the murder of two Primor employees! They slam the channels and flood it. Set up a desk here to monitor anything that comes in. He's very desperate. Let's go! Good actor, but I don't get what the desperation is unless... He was related to one of the gods, or like he had a French one. Done. No more favors, no more deals. This don't. I don't want to know what I'm doing, what you're doing, or why. You took this thing last night, or any of it. Finish up. Get out. We'll come back. Oof. Yeah, Cassian doesn't seem in favor of a lot of people. Yeah. I think it's just because he's u he uses a lot of them for his own gain, which is, you know, he's trying to survive, but at the same time, people won't take kind to that for very long. She's gonna follow. Oh my god, so precious. Oh shit! Nice! That was honestly very good. Very different from what we've ever felt, I think, from Star Wars. It's a very different tone. Very, like, um, what's the word? Very tense. Like, the, not the pacing, but more the tone. The tone is really tense, and you know that things are building up to something. So I feel like something big is going to happen in the next episode, or even the third episode, to sort of, like, pick up the pace a little bit in the story. But I love... The slow storytelling. I know a lot of people aren't going to like that. Um, <clears throat> when we have gone down this road, people are just like, eh, it's not good. It doesn't feel Star Wars-y. But for me, it's always good with a massive world as like Star Wars or even like there are other like worlds that I always look to with this. Like As long as there's a slow pace somewhere, that's really good because it captures the audience and brings a brand new story, brand new sort of like um, design of a show that sort of mixes everything up which is good and I hope that this is like the beginning of a new age for Star Wars shows going ahead like I want things to be more serious and I want us to go into a new path like I'm hoping like we get a new Star Wars movie soon that's very different and fur either further in the future um before any of this uh, not before after all of this because it's post Clone Wars post everything away from sort of like the Skywalker story and like bring in a new age of like new like Jedi and nothing to do with like Anakin and everything but just I love Anakin and stuff but it feels like it's being overworked at the moment so it's like give us something new to watch give us a new story anyway I'm loving this it's so good so we're gonna jump straight into the next episode because it's fantastic so thank you guys so much for watching this and I'll see you guys in the next episode crazy fangirl out